Hey good morning everyone my name is Vipin Kumar and I am back with another video how to build test and push docker containers in azure pipelines in this video we will see how to compose and build node.js app containers and how to push image on docker hub via azure pipeline to complete this demonstration you required three components one is you required a node.js application code for the compilation you can find or you can download node.js sample application code from my github account second you required a docker file to build a docker container you can also find docker file on same application folder let me show you the content of docker file this is very basic uh, docker file to build a docker container let me open this docker file in visual studio code to run a node.js application we required a node.js runtime environment machine for that i am using a node boron machine this is the node.js machine then in line number six i am changing the working directory is app folder in line number nine i am copying all the files of compile code on app folder on the machine in line number 12 i am downloading all the dependency and installing for node.js application in line number 15 i am starting the node.js on the command line in the container for node.js application this is the second requirement what is the next requirement we also required azure pipeline to compile application code and pushing or publishing application container on docker hub let me open the azure pipeline.yml file in visual studio this is the azure pipeline.yml file and i have already discussed about uh, uh, this file in previous video let me speak out uh, the important part of this file i am going to use a virtual image for ubuntu and i am creating a image name node.js sample dot build id in the step section i am downloading and installing all the dependency for the application on ubuntu machine then i am going to perform the test on application in line number 14 i am going to build a docker container by using docker file which we have already discussed and this is your docker container name docker id forward slash image name here docker id is your docker hub username and image name line number 15 we are going to login on docker hub by using docker id and password and line number 16 finally we are pushing our docker image on docker hub we also require to supply docker username and password in variables so that we can login on docker hub and push the docker containers i am not going to discuss lines from 20 to 30 because we have already discussed these line in details in our previous videos basically you can understand these lines are for application test and code coverage so let's create a azure pipeline for this demonstration so i have created a demo project for npm who required to help how to create a project you can refer my previous video in this series click on pipelines then select build at this moment we don't have any pipeline go ahead and create a new pipeline in this video i am not going to use quick way to create a pipeline like we did 
in last two videos instead of that i am going to use visual designer to create a pipeline click on use the visual designer select the repository for your code since my code is located on github make yourself authenticate or authorization on github account select the repository my code is located in this repository select and select the branch for the code and click on continue now you require a template since i am going to use a yaml file click on apply give the name for the pipeline so i selected or provided demo npm as a name and select the yaml file path click on variables here we require to create two variables one for docker hub user account and second password of docker hub click on add create second variables and value will be password of your docker hub account next one is save and queue save commits branch commit and click on save and queue pipeline has been created for node.js application let's go ahead and click on summary at this moment no build created go ahead and click on run and click on queue so you can see here version 3.0 has been created against build id click on version 3.0 you can see all these steps are going to be performed against this particular build id initialization agent is done initialization job is done initialization agent is done initialization job is done get source is done in this steps node js application is getting compiled and package then docker containers injecting application code in it and finally pushing back this container on docker hub location job has been completed for this particular pipeline you can see a summary report for the particular build process in the test section you can check test report for the application it is 100% pass you can check the code coverage report in this section this is the static for the code coverage of your application now look at your docker registry or docker hub for the container this is my docker public registry let me refresh it and you can see here under repository one more one more container has been added it is called node js sample container it was created or updated 4 minutes ago it is available to be download and use on docker's or kubernetes environment you can directly download on docker environment and use for 
Node.js application. Now we understood how to use Azure pipeline to build, test and publish the Docker containers on Docker Hub. You can also upload or publish this image on your private registry like Azure registry or your corporate private registry. That's all in this video. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.